Hey guys, my name is Sherez and today we'll go through the quick start guide which should help you familiarize yourself with your new Mudita bell. The full user manual is available for you at www.mudita.com. Your new alarm clock will consist of the following components. The alarm hand, the main button, the settings button on the left side, as well as the light button on the right. On the other side of the device, you'll find the back panel, which also features as your loudspeaker, the bigger knob being the alarm, and the smaller one being the time knob. At the bottom, you'll see a USB-C type port, which is how you will charge the device. Now for the time and alarm time settings. To set the current time or alarm time, turn the time knob or alarm knob on the back of the clock in the direction of the arrow. Navigation with the main button. A light click accepts your selection and progresses you forward. Use the slight push and feel the gentle click sound. Deep press. Deep press activates and deactivates the alarm. For a deep press, use a bit more pressure than for the light click. As a result, the main button will change position, causing the orange band to either be visible or not. To turn off a ringing alarm, deactivate it with a deep press. A light click or rotation of the main button will trigger a 10 minute snooze. If no interaction with the main button occurs, snooze will be triggered after 3 minutes of ringing and will be repeated 3 times. After 3 snoozes, the device will stop ringing. Press and hold the settings button for at least 2 seconds to access the free step alarm settings mode. At any time you can leave the alarm settings by pressing the settings button on the alarm clock. Step 1. Rotate the main button to change the sound of your alarm. You can choose from 10 different sounds. Lightly click on the main button to confirm your choice. You will automatically move to the next step where you'll be able to adjust the volume of your alarm. Step 2. Rotate the main button to adjust volume level. Light click on the main button to confirm your choice. You will automatically move to the next step. Step 3. Rotate the main button to turn the light on or off during wake up. The light will gently turn on at the designated alarm time. Light click on the main button to confirm your choice. To light up the clock face for 5 seconds, press the light button. To turn the light off, press the button again. To turn on the light for 10 minutes, press the light button for at least 2 seconds. To turn the light off, press the button again. While the light is on, rotate the main button to increase or decrease the light intensity. To turn the light off, press the button again. When the battery level is at less than 5%, a low battery level warning will be activated. Any interaction with the alarm clock will trigger the lights to flash and a low battery level warning to sound. Functionalities are limited to time indication and alarm functionality. The device should be plugged and charged immediately, otherwise it will be completely discharged and the mechanism will stop functioning. To charge the device, plug in a USB-C cable. Recommended power supply is 5 volts. Charging from 5 to 100% of battery might take approximately 5 hours. To reset your device, press the settings and light button simultaneously for at least 5 seconds. Release when you hear a ring sound and the light goes off. That will be all for today. Thank you for watching the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and let us know in the comments what sections you would like us to explain or perhaps explore.